Uh, Simone, describe to us sort of the scenes this morning and uh, the different parts of the city that you're in uh, and, uh, you know, what happens next. Good morning, uh, Yusuf. Of course, this uh, earthquake, 7.7, struck uh, at the epicenter near a town uh, called Gaziantep, which is in the southeastern region of Turkey, uh, near the Syrian border. Of course, rescue workers rushed into the scene. Uh, the quake was so strong, it was felt across many places, from Cyprus to Lebanon, and aftershocks were also felt across the region. Uh, now, the earthquake um, struck at around 4 a.m. Uh, Monday morning here. So far, at least uh, five people are reported dead, but hundreds are said to be trapped due to a uh, unknown number of collapsed buildings uh, across several provinces. Uh, rescue workers are racing to save them. Of course, it's still early there and still relatively dark. Uh, many mm -hmm. casualties are feared across 10 provinces. Now, earlier, Interior Minister Suleyman Soylu uh, spoke in Ankara and he said that Turkey has activated a fourth level alert, which includes international help. Uh, the weather mm -hmm. there is cold. Uh, we're seeing currently rainy conditions, and it's around two degrees okay. Celsius. Semen, for perspective for our global audience, uh, I mean, Turkey is used to a certain number of earthquakes uh, you know, over the years, but how does this compare to some of the others that they've seen? Uh, yeah, un unfortunately, earthquakes are very common uh, here in Turkey. Uh, the country lies in one of the world's most active seismic zones. Uh, among the big earthquakes that have struck the nation over the years, uh, 2011, there was an earthquake in the eastern city of Van, which was 7.1 in magnitude. Uh, the one today is 7.4 in magnitude. Uh, the one back in 2011, killing around 600 people and injuring thousands of others. Uh, in 1999, that was a devastating earthquake that struck northwestern Turkey, killing 18,000 people. Uh, unfortunately, Turkey is very experienced in dealing with these deadly earthquakes.